Hello everyone, this is Yoshi5, and, <clears throat> excuse me, and here I are, here, what did I just say? Yeah, here I am, re-recording this audio again, because I screwed it up the first time. Yeah, whoops. Anyway, we basically have 40 stars, so now we can take on the second Bowser level. Yep, the path opens up, and here we are. Sorry if Mario can now advance, and let's see what the name of this galaxy is. Okay, uh, Bowser's Gravity Gauntlet, huh? Alright, doesn't seem too bad. If... okay. Come on. Pass me, thing. I must have been talking about something there that I forgot about. Oh well, that's not been too important. Bowser's Gravity Gauntlet. Breaking into Bowser's Castle. Ooh, that sounds fun. That's well, actually that's one of the things that, um, kind of disappointed me about the other 3D Mario games. That you didn't have, um... A really cool, like, breaking the Bowser's Castle sequence. I mean, Bowser in the Sky in Super Mario 64 was alright, and uh, Corona Mountain in Super Mario Sunshine was, um. It was, it was okay. But uh, I really liked how um, Super Mario Galaxy games actually had, sort of had a feel of. I don't know, you really felt like you were actually taking on Bowser in his domain instead of just, you know, Peach's Castle and Isle Delfino and stuff. So, anyway, just, you just had a real, um. Not really 2D, but sort of 2D area right here. Nothing too bad. Just go over here. I don't think the con. Whoops. Yeah, I was gonna time myself very well. I don't think. Yeah, I, right here I got confused if I where the con metal was, but it's actually up ahead here. Oops. Yeah, that's, that's kind of an awkward jump to make. Yeah, just spin magic goobas. They shouldn't pose too much of a problem. They give you coins, and you don't really need that many coins anyway, so don't worry about it. And yet the commels right up here. You just grab it, and we're good to go. Uh, yeah, it's, I really wasn't paying attention here. I'm not sure what I was thinking. Okay, we got a point here. Yeah, yeah, I was not playing very well right here. Okay, I I, I do better next time though. Okay, two lives. Ooh. Okay, now we have to just remember we have to grab the commel again. This one's just, they kind of just give it to you on this one. I don't even think you need the block right there, you can just... Uh, I thought I said I was going to do better! Anyway, I don't even think you need a block to get a comment all the time, I just don't probably do it. Okay, yeah, here, okay, here I am, I'm finally being a little more patient with my jumps. Yeah, some cool effect, uh, <laughs> effects in the fireballs right here. Uh, um, what else is coming up here? Oh yeah, this part. The physics here fails majorly, but, you know, whatever, we'll go with it. If you touch this uh, big question mark coin right here, you get a bunch of regular coins, which again, they don't really do much except, you know, fill your air, so that might be helpful. But if you're, if you're, uh, if you've been practicing your swimming, then you probably should get, you can probably get through it without the coins. But here we are at a checkpoint. So just come down here. Oh, oh shoot. Okay, that was kind of hard to tell, but I kind of jumped and kind of slid off that, off the, um, walks. Stomach, so oh, that's kind of funny. Almost got myself killed. Alright. Um. Wait, what's that part? I think I died in this part, actually. Oh, okay, here's another move that I. Now, you have since the beginning of the game, but I don't think I talked about. If you, um, spin and then you do a ground pound, you kind of do like a homing ground pound. <laughs> yeah, some of these jumps are kind of awkward. Oh! Yeah, I said that. I don't know. I kind of died on the cheap shot right there. But anyway, like I said, oh yeah, we have to start back at the. Oops, wrong way. Oh, okay, we got the starfish though. Yeah, just crawl underneath these guys to, or you can um, when they notice you just run back, and it's pretty easy to avoid all in all. Uh, they're womps, right? They're not thwomps. No, thwomps are the the guys that crush the blue guys that crush down on you. Thwomps are the cement guys that. Um, yeah. Okay. Ah, I made the same mistake twice. That is not good. Oh, well, that was close. Uh, so I think we come down here. Well, it's, you probably go either way, I think. Yeah. No, we have to go the other way on this one. Uh, yeah, just... Arr, watch out for the fires, obviously. I shouldn't, uh... Hinder you that much. But, you know. Okay, so here we are, finally at the end, right before the Bowser fight. 
I placed the meteors here. Just ground pound, ground pound and break open the door. Okay, there's this few star bits over here, and of course, like always, if you break this one, you have a life stream. Okay, so now we have three locks right here. It's the same deal as last time, you just need a ground pound meteor to break open the locks. And we'll just wait for it to come up again. Number two, number two is three down. And here's our last one. Kinda aiming a little bit, and... Yep, yeah, good enough. Alright, let's see what Bowser has in store for us this time. And we're... Huh? He's a no-show. Huh? Hey, Lumen, get back here. You're gonna get yourself hurt. Huh? Hey! I'm scared to Luma. What? It's you! Oh, I did not expect you, Mr. Bond. Sorry. Well, I expect as much from my arch nemesis. Your time is up, Mario. Now it's mushing time, and time for my huge fist to meet your puny face. Oh, hey! Oh, you're scared to Luma, you big jerk. Okay, here's a a similar fight. Um, the similar fight compared to last time. Not really a whole bunch has changed, except when he. When his fist comes crashing down, he'll create um, a dark energy wave. Just jump to avoid it. Nothing too major, nothing too difficult. It'd it kind of been cool if it was like Mega Lake, where you had to crawl onto the boom and then do deal damage that way. And we only have two meteors this time, so don't crush them both like I think I was able to. Well, I could have got a good hit on him right there, but I didn't aim it very well. I can't really blame the camera on that one, that was just me being stupid. Okay. Got the meteors. Again, oh, they, they also uh, sent out shockwaves too. In case you couldn't see it. Okay, I think I, I'm able to get, get him right in the armpit that time. For, but for some reason, he uh, puts his hand on his head. I don't get it. Okay, so I believe we need to hit him four times. Uh, just like last time. Okay. Oh! Okay, and let's see here. Oh! oh! Okay, I guess I did get him that time. That was close. I guess I hit him on the stomach. Oh, he's angry now. No, no. And here we go. Of course, we, here we are with fire again. Uh, it is a little bit harder to avoid this time, because it actually um, stays on the stage a little bit longer than the last time. But again, it shouldn't be too difficult, except I was stupid and wasn't standing there in meteors when this fist came down, so I kind of wasted some time there. Oh, shoot! Shoot! <laughs> ah! My biscuits are a-burning! Okay. Okay, come on! Hit me! Hit me! Okay, no. Okay, nothing's good. Nothing's good. Hit him right in the arm that time. Just one more hit, and he should be done for. Ow, whoops. Okay, now he's being stupid. Oh. Okay, I think he should be just about done. We just need to make sure we don't destroy any of the meteors. This time we're actually close to one. Oh, I think I screwed it up that time. Or not. Oh, I hit him right in the shin. Maybe a little bit too close to... Ah, uh, never mind. Anyway, he spits up the grand star again. Ew. Oh, that looks like it hurt. Well, he must have fell a long ways. Then again, we fell a long ways too. What? How? Ah, whatever. My master plan is too far along now, Mario. You can't stop me. Wah, ha, ha, ha. Yeah, whatever, dude. You say that every time. Then he's just... just Black magic to disappear. <laughs> I love the Luma's just dancing in the background there. He doesn't care, he's just having a good time. Alright, so here we have a Grand Star, and I shouldn't have took, taken so much damage on that fight, but oh well. Yeah. Wow! Yeah. We got a Grand Star! I wonder 
what's the difference in making a Grand Star and a Power Star? I mean, I know they talked about it in the last Super Mario Galaxy, but is it just a bigger Voluma, or a... I don't know. Uh, anyways, a portal to the next world opened up. Now we get our stats. It's gonna take me eight and a half minutes to do that. Yeah, that's not terrific. Okay, so we got another common metal. Star bits, coins, you know, basic deal. Great work there, pal. You did it! You found the fourth grand star. Ah, of course we did. You fought that monster again? <laughs> Looks like he looked big more, bit more banged up than last time. He's getting stronger, eh? We need to stop that monster before he gets any more powerful. Mm. Yeah, fair enough, I guess. Alright then, let's hit it on the double, Captain. Alright, and off we go again. Gecko noises! And, it was World 5 gonna look like. Ooh. There's uh, a lot of fun galaxies in this um, world, actually. Oh, Lou is lo Lobo looks serious now. This place, it looks like we might be pretty well, might be pretty well protected. I bet you we're moving right in on the enemy's home base. What do you say we drop in unannounced? Maybe the baddies will have some, uh, will have some snacks for us when we show up? Ha ha. Hey, he was trying to sound all epic there and he kind of failed at the end. Alright, it's all up to you, Cap- uh, I mean, it's all you, Captain. Uh, thanks, Lubba. Thanks for, uh, giving us your ship, and I guess that's about it. Uh, still, e either way. Well, uh, yeah, I, get, I better not start the galaxy right now. I'm starting right out of time. So this has been Fioji Beautiful Yoshi 5 with Super Mario Galaxy 2, and next time we start World 5. Okay, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Peace out.